Hello everyone, your favorite Senso Tech Jedi back with number 10 in this classroom management learning series. Uh, we're going to talk about closed tab today. This is a really good one. Uh, this does work on both Windows and Chrome devices, but I do have a little bit of a caveat on there. On Windows devices, it's going to work only in the Chrome browser. This was really developed to help our users that have Chromebooks uh, to be able to close tabs that are open remotely. So that is why it is locked into the Chrome browser. So what I've done on these devices, I have opened up several websites because I want to show you what that looks like. So let me make this a little bit bigger. So you have um, both these Chromebooks and you have the PCs down here. I've opened up several tabs on both of those devices. So you would utilize this. You see someone that is on a tab they're not supposed to be on or you're trying to close tabs all the way down to the desktop. This would be a great tool for that. So I'm going to go ahead and open up close tab. I'm going to select just one of the Chromebooks at first to show you how this looks. So let me go ahead and go to full screen on that one. And I'm going to run and you'll see that it's going to close the active tab and if I keep clicking it it will close the active tab all the way down to the essentially the desktop of the Chromebook so uh, same thing on this Chromebook and then let, let me show you what it's gonna look like on a Windows device okay it's on the active tab so it just depends this one it's whatever the active tab is showing click run it's gonna close that down now you can do this across multiple devices so let's select all of them except for the one that doesn't have anything open it wouldn't hurt if you kept that selected it just wouldn't run the tool so don't think you have to deselect that it's fine um, I'm gonna go ahead and click run and you'll see that it will close the active tab of all the devices or if I'm wanting to close all my active devices all the way down to the desktop within a Chrome browser, it will do that if I keep clicking on it. And that's how you use Close Active Tab. All right, guys, I'll see you in the next one.